Hi. Hi. Uh, please introduce yourself. Uh, I'm Joseph from Argon40. Uh, we're a Hong Kong based company that uh, we produce enclosure system for. What is this? This is a NAS system for Raspberry Pi. So you can actually put the Raspberry Pi inside and you can actually support four bay hard drive. 3.5 inch to 2.5? Two, three point five and two two point five, but you can actually put two four uh, two point five here. How good is the Raspberry Pi to run the NAS? It's pretty good. I mean, uh, it, the, it, it, Raspberry it, Pi five. Even uh, this one is four, but I mean, uh, even at four, it's it could be at par with most of the uh, I mean NAS system out in the market. But I mean, with the Raspberry Pi five, we're gonna do a upgrade, and I think it would be I mean one of the best system NAS system out in the market. What do we see here? Um, so these are different types of enclosures for, for Raspberry Pi uh, 5. Um, so for this one, uh, it's Argon 1 system. Uh, we have the Pi inside. Uh, so we routed all the ports at the back. So I mean, you have a better cable management. This one is actually made out of aluminum alloy. So it has a good uh, thermal management for the Pi 5. And at the back, there's a magnetic cover where you can actually remove and you can still have access to all the GPI port, GPI ports for the Raspberry Pi 5. And we have a bottom expansion where you can actually add a MBME with the heatsink at the bottom. So, I mean, it's a complete system for a Pi 5. Is this for, for sale? System. It's for sale right now. I just saw somebody said that they have it. Um, so people yes. buy it? Uh, we have quite a lot of people buying it for, for the Raspberry Pi solution. If where, where they buy it? Um, so we have several resellers uh, here in Europe, but I mean, it's also Amazon? Um, available in Amazon US. Amazon. Yes. What's the price? So for this one, it's actually 49 US dollar. Uh, we have a simple system without the, I mean, without the, without the MBME, uh, just the bottom. Um, this one goes for 30 US dollar. Did you say how much? 30 US dollar. 30? 30. 30 US dollar. With, yeah. Without the MBME system. Ah, okay. So I mean, with the MBME, it's 49 US dollar. All right. Yeah. And uh, which other one you want to show? So I mean, we have the, I mean, this one is also a Pi system. Um, it, it has a Pi inside and it, 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 it integrated inside. Um, and you have the 8 inch and the 10 inch. Uh, so you have a 1080p display. And you have all the controls still at, at available to you. Nice. What is this one? So this is our entry level case for Raspberry Pi. So it's it's the cheapest available one that if you don't need I mean it has anything you need to get Pi running, even the cooling. But I mean it, it, you don't have to pay a lot for this one. So I mean you're looking at a five dollar solution for a Raspberry Pi How enclosure. Much? Five US dollar. Five US dollar? Mm -hmm. uh, available? Available end of the month. All right, and what are these coolers there? So Do people overclock their Raspberry Pis? So if you need to overclock your Raspberry Pi, this is the best solution that you can have in the market right now. It is possible to overclock it? It's, it is possible to overclock it. Uh, I mean, you can check somebody who actually done, they actually overclock a Raspberry Pi to 3.2 gigahertz with this cooler. 3.3 gigahertz? 3.2. 3.2, yeah. and uh, there's a case for this? Um, right now, I mean, you can 3D print your own case. Uh, we don't offer any case right at the moment, but I mean, you can make your own solution with the, with the, with the cooler. All right. Um, so any idea you have, you can just make it? Yes. So, and you don't uh, just 3D print them, right? You, How can, you, mass, you have mass production? You need a mold and everything? So for the other product, we do actually have mold for those, and uh, they are mass manufactured, yes. All right. Yes. Because uh, millions of people use the, these kind of boards, right? Yes. And as many... Do. Uh, Raspberry Pi compatible boards, uh -huh. they all work in the same case? Uh, at least for this one, they are for Pi 5. Uh, for Pi 4, it's a different form factor. So you actually, we also have those for the Pi 4. All right. Cool. Is it a good show here at Embedded World? Yes. Uh, we've been learning a lot also ourselves. We've been talking to a lot of people. So, I mean, they're giving us, I, I mean, they're giving us good feedback about our product. I mean, some give appreciation and some give some suggestions on what what to do more.